Alright guys, today I'm going to be doing a review of the Fresh E-Tech Splash Shower Tunes. Now this speaker is a fantastic little speaker. It uh, has Bluetooth 3.0 I believe, which is really great. I know the latest is 4.0, but 3.0 seems to be working great. Um, it's got nice little features, you know, it's got the power button of course, there, play and pause, skip, rewind, answer calls, hang up calls, little microphone hole there, um, suction cup, which is where the splash and shower comes from, and this speaker is actually meant for your shower or bathtub, but I've read somewhere that you cannot fully submerge it that's why they call it just a splash one because it can get wet with no problem but you know if you fully submerge it it might have problems it is waterproof um, the, spe the speaker is supposed to be water resistant um, so you shouldn't have a problem using this in your shower or your bathtub um, the only complaint that I have about the suction cup is it won't work on textured surfaces like this counter is textured try to stick it to it and it doesn't work so you have to have it on a surface that it can't air can't escape from maybe it'll work better if you put a little water on it or something I don't know but it'll it should work pretty good in a shower as long as you don't have a bunch of textured tiles and that's things of that sort but here's the bottom of the box it shows a shower getting it wet and it also comes in blue pink orange or yellow and green and it says listen to music skip bad songs answer calls reads text to you all from your shower now um, the guys at fresh e-tech sent this to me to review and they strongly told me to emphasize that all the speakers that you find on eBay or Amazon that resemble this or have their name on the ad and are very cheap are all fakes. They told me that they're cheap knockoffs and that the ones on their website which are which is www.freshetech.com are the only ones that are legitimate and built to high quality standards. Now, um, the reason I say, and I am emphasizing on this a lot, is the ones that you find on Amazon that are like $18 have a lot of negative reviews saying that they got a fake one that broke or battery lasted like 20 minutes, things like that. Now, I haven't had any issues with this speaker at all. I, in fact, used it at work for about seven hours straight of listening to it and very loudly too because I work in manufacturing I have to have high volume device and this does wonders so I was going to do an unboxing on this I'll just leave it like this this is how it came in the box it came in this plastic container here and the reason I didn't leave it in there is because the light shines on it too brightly and you can't see a dang thing so this is how it came in the box, like this. And all the sides are open, so you can see the speaker and everything about it, which is fantastic. In here, you have your USB charging cable, and it is not like a normal cell phone charging cable. It's got its own little round deal here, but it is normal USB. And then you have your manual of course and it tells you troubleshooting and things of that sort now this speaker charges right here like I said a little tiny port um, it's great it's super loud the speakers on the bottom and at first I thought that the speak the sound wouldn't be too loud due to the that the speaker would be against the surface but in a way it kind of works it kind of bounces the sound off of your object or your wall and amplifies it almost so it almost seems like 
it's better that it's on the bottom versus the top. Um, well, one, the one, another thing that I don't like about it is no auxiliary port, which it is meant for the shower, so you're not going to need the auxiliary port if you're in the shower. But if you use it as an everyday speaker, it would be great to have an auxiliary port. It works with all the Bluetooth devices I've tried it on. I have a second or third generation iPod Touch that works flawlessly with this. I have a Lenovo Yoga 8 tablet that works great with this. And if you want me to review that, just leave a comment. And my old Motorola Triumph works flawlessly with it. And this speaker is absolutely phenomenal for sound and um, the skip and the pause and play are work almost instantly which is kind of hard to find I have a speaker another Bluetooth speaker that I might review that the fast forward pause and play and everything take like three or f three to five seconds to actually work it lags a lot but this doesn't and I'm going to connect it to my tablet so you can see how it works and how it sounds and then after that I will suction it to probably my counter my or my cupboard since that's like the only smooth surface I have to access right now and show you how it sounds and how it, well it holds on to surfaces so um, I'm gonna go get my tablet I'll sync it to this and show you how easy it is to synchronize it and I will be right back alright so now I'm going to connect it to my tablet so you can see how well the controls work and how well it sounds so all you do of course you gotta activate your Bluetooth on your t device turn the speaker on Hold the button until it makes a noise. And since I've had it synchronized to my tablet already, it should work. Like I'm automatically since it's in range. See what it says connecting now, you can't really see that. It's right there. So for some reason it didn't do it automatically that time. But now it's connected, so that was pretty quick and easy. Didn't have to do a password or anything. And now, go back to my music. Hit play here, since I already have a track loaded. Okay, so that's how it sounds on full blast, just how it is, not suction anything since my counter won't let it do it. So now I'll suction it to my cupboard so you can see how well it is, how well of a suction it can get, and how it sounds while it's compressed. Because when you compress this, it's pretty, it almost seems like it would block the speaker, but it really doesn't. It's actually pretty awesome. So I'll try to do this real quick here go up to my counter or my cupboard side of my cupboard it's the only thing I have right around here that I can get a good suction on it but go like that and press it firmly I'll zoom in here real quick but you press it firmly against there until it doesn't want to give up when you pull on it sometimes you have to stick your nail back here just to get air in there so just to get it off of there so I'm gonna hit play let it play while it's suctioned to the side so you can hear what it, se what it sounds like
All right, so my cupboard's not exactly the best for the suction effect on this. You know, we might if you, you have trouble getting it suctioned to something, you might want to put a little, maybe a little bit of water on the inside of the suction cup, and it might get a better seal. But um, that's just what I've experienced with previous suction cups items before. But this thing sounds phenomenal. I know on camera probably doesn't do any justice like every normal bluetooth speaker review you'll see everyone will probably say oh i saw a review on this and it sounds nothing like the video that's how i feel about this one it is great it the videos do, do not do it justice so if you're looking for a speaker that you can use in the shower or something don't want to miss important phone calls while you're in the shower or in the bathtub or something get this it is great it's waterproof you can answer your calls with that button talk into it with the microphone and yeah it's fantastic i've been using it as an everyday speaker too i work in manufacturing like i said and i suction it to the table at work so i can't knock it off the ground hit the concrete floor or anything it it's uh it's pretty awesome so and it's loud enough. I work next to a bunch of machinery that's very loud and it just works great. So if you're looking for an everyday speaker with the convenience of also being able to take it in the shower with you, then I recommend this highly. So thanks for watching. Review on the tablet will be coming soon, so look out for that. And if you have any other suggestions or requests, then comment below. I also have a Vizio M-Series 50-inch TV I might review, a uh, Samsung Tab 3 I'm going to review, I have another speaker that I'm going to be reviewing, and a couple other things around, so stay tuned, and thank you for watching.